Hello everyone! We hadn't had an update on Brooke Wells for a while. In the meantime, the girl managed not only to recover from the injury and make an amazing comeback, but to also become the leader of her team, PRVN, since their number one, Tia Claire Toomey, will miss this season due to pregnancy. Naturally, the leader's status is not official and is given to her not because of her experience in eight CrossFit Games tournaments, but for her level and results at this moment. I remind you that this season we've already witnessed open and quarter final stages, in which Brooke ended up on the 6th and the 5th positions, beating almost all top-of-the-line athletes. And considering the level of competition at this moment, no one really expected such results from this cute-looking girl, especially after such an injury. It definitely deserves respect. It's fair to note that Brooke's coach also played a big part in this. Shane Orr managed to bring the girl back her confidence. And generally speaking, the credit goes to the whole PRVN team. Brooke's twin sister, by the way, also trains there. Sydney Wells just started conquering CrossFit, but she is already doing quite well. She had recently finished the quarterfinal on the 27th spot, giving up just three spots to the legendary Sarah Sigmunds Dottir and beating the machine Danny Spiegel by six points. This allows her to continue the fight in the semi-final to try and win the first in her life ticket to the CrossFit Games. As for Brooke, she has been working hard the whole year and is on her way to set her best season. And she also recently shared the news that she's been writing a book called Resilient, in which she covers her way from the injury to recovery, how she battled fear and where she gets such crazy motivation. Even though this is her first effort, I think it's gonna be an interesting read for the girls' fans and some other people. We wish the girls luck and to quote Brooke's Instagram, the real fun is about to start.